but I'm told Stephen Smith oh. is ready for a conversation. Smudge. Oh, I don't know what to say. 85, it was there. Well batted, by the way. Well batted. Thank you. Um, firstly, Dave, is he all right? Uh, I assume he's fine, yeah. He just scored 200, so um, I assume he's good. <laughs> it, was, it was obviously pretty hot out there. He was cramping a little bit or cramping a lot, um, and I think he's continuing to cramp a bit in there. So uh, exceptional innings, wasn't it? You, I'll let Merv have a cracky at the second. Your innings was pretty fine as well. Um, how oppressive was that today? It was high 30s it was it was brutal you've played in bad conditions tough conditions around the world how does that compare yeah it wasn't very nice today considering i got the flu as well so um yeah i didn't feel great out there throughout the whole day um so yeah fortunate to put on a, a nice partnership with davy there and um put us in a pretty good position um obviously it was an ideal end to the day with uh mm. davy coming off and then greeny copping one as well so um yeah, we're still in a good place. Hopefully those guys, or a couple of guys, will be able to bat tomorrow. Yeah. Now, Steve, g'day, mate. Merv Hughes hey. here. Um, just got a quick one for you. The, the partnership today, how important was that to be there um, with your good mate in his 100th test match to get a, a 200 partnership? Did that play um, any impact on how you played, or was it just another game of cricket for you? No, not really. I was just, <laughs> just playing the game. And, uh, yeah, fortunate, obviously, to be out there for, to witness that. It was, a, it was a tremendous innings right from ball one yesterday. He looked on and just played played really good cricket, um, you know, and, and the way he went about it today, I think. After he got to 100, he, he just kept playing his shots. And um, I think because he was cramping, he started playing a few more shots and uh, got them all away, fortunately. So, um, yeah, it was a tremendous innings. and It was, it was nice to be out the other end for most of it. Uh, now, you spoke about the injuries already, so that the finger of... Of Green, obviously, Mitch Stark um, did or well, went off the field yesterday with a finger injury. Um, do you know how bad they are? Is that going to impact the side for Sydney? Uh, yeah, I'm not entirely sure. I think Starkey's going to try and have a hit. I think I'm, I'm not sure whether he's going to bowl or not. He's been trying, but um, we'll wait and see. And I'm not even sure about Greeny at the moment. I was up top the whole time, so I haven't actually haven't seen him or, or anyone yet. But um, didn't look good with the, the blood coming out the back of the, the finger. That's never a, a nice sign. All right. Were you physically... Uh, we saw Dave early hundreds. He was really physically struggling and fighting that. Were you in a place where we, at any point where you felt like you were struggling a bit? Yeah, my whole innings. <laughs> and my, no, my forearm was cramping for probably just after lunch. Um, so I had to change the way I was batting for, for a period there. Just... Just changed my, my hand on the bat slightly, but, um, yeah, it uh, wasn't the most comfortable conditions out there. No. Now, you said to me, last question, because we've got to go, you've got to do other interviews. Last test, or one of, you don't bowl anymore. Steve, you might have to bowl, and if there's no cam and, and Mitch has got the finger, you might have to pull out the old leggies. Take the new ball. <laughs> yeah, Man's already been talking himself up, up there <laughs> just before, so... Uh, yeah, I don't know. He might bowl a few seamers. I might bowl a few spinners. Who knows? We'll, uh, we, we, might, we all might get a bowl. We'll see how we go. All right. Well done today, 85 yep. well done. and a great partnership with Dave Warner and putting an Australia in a pretty much uh, unassailable position. Thanks, Steve.